Hello everybody, welcome back. Um, we'll do, uh, today we're gonna do uh, a Sugar Shack update uh, video. Uh, just let you know how everything's going on and uh, what changes we're doing. Uh, we got some building to do in the shack to get ready for the upcoming season. It's uh, mid-February right now. Uh, well, getting to be mid-February. It uh, season's going to come here soon. I, I see uh, down uh, south of us. I'm in Ontario, so south of us, states-wise, there's uh, they're starting to tap already. Um, nothing in Vermont or anything like that yet, but uh, it's coming. It's uh, slowly getting warmer today. This week is actually going to be a beautiful beautiful week it's uh gonna be calling for somebody going by uh it's calling for uh zero degrees or celsius zero celsius uh so it's gonna be it's warming up but then it's supposed to dip back down to get colder so it's not not topping season yet but it's getting close uh upcoming videos here I, you've probably seen a sawmill video of uh cutting lumber sawing lumber if you're on the channel some of the lumber that I saw it up. Uh, some of this is going for to refinish the uh, basement. And some of it, hopefully, uh, I can finish off. I'll explain to you up in the sugar shack. Hopefully finish off some of the sugar shack when you enter in and uh, give it a finished look. Um, and some of this as well is going for, uh, uh, going to be going for a, a deer blinds. Some of the deer blinds we make. I want to do a video show you guys how to uh, how make a, how we make a deer blind or whatever. And then I got some squares here. Some of this is going for uh, to make an actual sign, a uh, Gould to the Maple sign, up by the road. So this summer, uh, when people are driving by, they can see uh, fresh syrup for sale. Um, a lot of our sales come from locals uh, you can't beat your locals uh, they're wonderful wonderful people they come back every year they're excited to see your syrup they're excited to have your syrup um, you, you just you can't beat local sales uh, it's the best um, we also have uh, some lumber here for our uh, it's going to be our uh, syrup uh, syrup stand um, I'm going to build that I might I probably do a video on that a uh, quick video show you how we're building it and uh, uh, kind of a roadside stand but it's going to be down here in the yard uh, so hopefully the sign can draw people in and we'll have a, a stand here uh, for camp wood we're making our walk up to the sugar shack you can see that we have quite a bit of snow here that platform there that runs these hills here all comes down to the year to a 55 gallon drum and usually that platform is to my knees and that's above above that platform so we got a fair bit of snow um quite a bit of snow i did uh i did break trail took the blower out the tractor and i uh, did the trails going back to the sap tanks and uh it's <laughs> quite a bit of snow but it is it wasn't bad to to blow out the trails uh a little rough but not too bad hopefully they freeze up and it'll all be good uh, in that sugar shack here now uh, don't mind the mess it's gonna get a little lot messier before it gets better here once we get everything organized and good to go got a bunch of new bottles different bottles this year got a lot of glass this year as well uh, the reason why we got the glass a lot more glass this year is because our new filter press this is a cdl <laughs> seven bank filter press um electric pump try that out um, make nicer cleaner syrup and the start of the show here <laughs> we got a we got ourselves a 250 gallon cdl uh arrow uh 250 gallon hobby arrow so i've been uh figuring this out and hope we get set up so we got some changes to do in here our big head tank it's going to the opposite side and this is going to be this room here will be for our uh syrup filtering and bottling this whole side here and then the ro and the head tank it'll be going all the drops yet they put on 
quite a few. <laughs> I got uh, switching, sorry, switching to uh, 5 16 drops instead of 3 16 drops. Uh, they seem to work a lot better. I can explain that in another video. I'm going to do a 3 16 video, uh, line video. The reason why we're switching to 5 16 drops. But uh, back to back on track here. The head tank is going to go above these two tanks. I'm going to put a little platform across. And the head tank's going to sit up in here and feed the evaporator. So then I'll have a sap tank, a concentrate tank, <clears throat> and, a wa and a water tank, sorry, for straight water for uh, washing out the RO and whatnot. Uh, I don't know, our nice new wood cart we got here. A lot better, a lot nicer than the old wheelbarrow. It's gonna be really handy. Fill that up, should be good for a few hours, half a day, or better, hopefully. And uh, hopefully the season runs. Season is better than last year. Last year we didn't didn't do the best. Uh, it got too warm too fast. We didn't have those cold nights and. Uh, well, we had lots of warm days, but not many cold nights. Um, so it kind of made syrup production not, not the greatest. Uh, hopefully this year it'll redeem itself and we'll have a banger year and it'll be lots of syrup, lots of syrup to sell. I even got this year, trying to spruce it up in here a little more every year, uh, Christmas lights. I like love Christmas lights up and around the windows. Look good, so when people come and... Hopefully come for a visit and any questions or any, any questions about surfing or tapping or how we do it here are curious. Hopefully they come along and take a look and I can answer any questions you have. And I'll turn you back on once we get to ripping stuff apart anyways.